On a dark Easter night, a small village near Mexico City waits for creatures from another world. They arrive, spewing fire and flame. These are the Shimos, demons over six meters tall. Every Easter, they're created and destroyed in Santa Rosa Sochiac. Huge teams spend months on their Shimo, like the 140 strong Espinosa clan. We visited as they applied the finishing touches. Family patriarch Eduardo and his son explained why they made so much effort for such a brief finale. When they're burnt, it represents killing all the evil of the past year, so that only the good remains. The day before the burning, the Shimos are dragged through the town streets and paraded in the square. It's a surreal, rambunctious celebration where monsters mix with diabolical clowns and a giant demonic bull menaces the crowd. 97-year-old Felipe Lopez still doesn't get tired of the spectacle. She's proud of the unique tradition of the village she helped found many years ago. The young have that energy, that joy in participating, and that's why this tradition has continued until now and will carry on. The Shimo sprung up from the wider Catholic tradition of burning red devils, like these ones, as effigies of Judas, the disciple who betrayed Jesus. At some point here, those classic Mexican figures mutated into something else entirely. No one seems to know exactly how the tradition evolved into these mythical figures, but the people here in Santa Rosa say that their very name, Shimo, comes from the pre-Hispanic Nahuatl language, which suggests a fusion of the indigenous and the Catholic worlds. But even as the Shimos have their day in the sun, their end is near. In a blaze of fire and fury, evil is vanquished. Until next Easter. John Holman, Al Jazeera, Santa Rosa, Mexico.